Hey everybody, it's been a while. Um, I wanted to come at you with a Kroger haul. Um, they had a lot of coupons this week, a lot of digital coupons. Um, everything cost about $99. I did buy two items that you do not see that cost about $10. Um, half gallon of milk. Um, the two items that I bought that was around $10 are these um, little mini brands that my daughter likes to play with. They're like mystery balls. Um, but anyways, I did buy some soda too, and I'll show that here shortly. But um, basically everything that I've purchased here, it's not, you know, it's not wholesome food, but it is just quick foods. We are moving soon. We got probably about another month and we'll be in our new house. So we're trying to cook things that are very basic. They had these Screaming Sicilian pizzas to buy, um, buy two, get them for the same price as buying one. So they came out to be about $4 each if you wanted to look at it that way. So they got the Holy Pepperoni, which we've never had, and the Supreme Maximus. So hopefully those are good. Um, we got two of the Kroger, I'm sorry, Stouffer meatloaf meals. They had these five for 10 or Stouffer meals. And then I got three of the Lean Cuisine uh, Salisbury steak and macaroni and cheese. I like that one. Um, I had a free digit a coupon for a uh, free Stouffer's French bread pizza. So I got one of the boxes for free and then I bought another one. My husband and I both like French bread pizza. Um, got my daughter some Chef Boyardee pastas, spaghetti and meatballs. Oh, actually, I think that one's my husband's and the other one's my daughter's. I got some watermelon spears because yes, I can make my own, but I just don't want the hassle of actually opening up a whole big watermelon. So um, I, I had them already um, pre-made. So I love the watermelon spears. Hot Pockets, we got ham and cheddar, uh, chicken, broccoli and cheddar. And then a, well, another one of those. And I think we got a pizza one. Yeah, the pizza um, Hot Pocket. They were $1.79 a box. And those are nice to have on hand. Um, I got the Fruity Marshmallow Pebbles. I think I got, I paid like a 99 cents for these boxes after it was all said and done. So I got, I've never had this one. My daughter loves pe uh, loves cereal and so does my husband. Um, and then I got just a regular Cocoa Pebbles. Um, two of the Michelina macaroni and cheese. My daughter loves those. I did get a Actually, I had just a little bit of the rotisserie chicken. Um, these are really, really good from Kroger. And uh, I'm going to shred it and make like a pulled chicken barbecue. Uh, I got, my husband picked these up for my daughter, uh, for my dog. I usually don't buy these types of things. So we'll see if they make them sick. Um, but yeah, there's some kind of waffle. I got two of the Boathouse Farms Classic Ranch. If you've never had this and you like a lower calorie option for ranch, instead of making it yourself, um, this is really good. It's a little bit over $3. Sometimes you can get the bigger bottle for around four. Um, but two tablespoons, 45 calories. It tastes to me like regular ranch. Um, it's really, really good in my opinion, so. Um, I always have that in the house. Um, I bought the farm rich breaded mozzarella sticks. These are awesome in the um, air fryer at 400 for probably about 15 minutes. That's what I use them. All right, so I'm going to put this stuff away and show you some more things. All right, so this is a mess, but um, so we got some diet Dr. Pepper these were four for 11, these six packs. We got some Coke Zero. We got some of this A&W Zero Sugar. I'm gonna tell you, if you like root beer and you you know, like a diet soda, this is really good. Um, I got actually two of these six packs. Um, weird clearance item, but we couldn't find these when school started, so we had to use an old one, but um, you know, you can't, bring art boxes anymore. So they have, uh, the school requires them to have pencil boxes. This one was $2.49 and I thought that was a good buy. 
so I bought that to save for next year. Um, tomato, just a regular old tomato. Um, raspberries, we love Driscoll raspberries or any kind of berry from Driscoll's. It's the bomb. Um, we got one big Vidalia onion. Always get every season of the Pillsbury ready to bake sugar cookies. Always. My family loves them. Um, just a regular thing of Colby Jack shredded. This was another random clearance item for like 75 cents. My daughter wanted one, even though, I mean, I told her it was for hot drinks. She really doesn't like hot drinks. And of course we got asparagus. We love asparagus in the air fryer. Well, y'all, that seems to be it. We went to the flea market today. We bought a couple pieces of furniture. Um, <clears throat> like, I'm looking to make a coffee bar at my, well, hot beverage bar, whatever, because I, I don't drink as much coffee as I like to think I do, but um, I do like to have tea. I do like tea a lot. And um, so, and plus I like to have, um, you know, access to it very easy. So I want to make a coffee bar, but I can't find what I need to make it. Um, I know I can buy already made items, yes. But <clears throat> I am a person that's really particular about my furniture because I have bought, paid thousands and thousands of dollars for furniture in my lifetime. And it's just like they make stuff so crappy. Um, but, I mean, obviously my couches and, and everything, I have to buy um, newer consignment items. So, um, but I did find some really cute fixer upper uh, shelving, like for the entryway. And then I found this really cool, like cedar chest type situation. So, um, my husband's actually getting them prepared to paint. And um, so that's what he's doing right now. Uh, but anyways... Basically, um, we're, we're, we've, our house is completely packed to the gills right now. I, I'm, I am actually starting to get kind of anxiety because I just, I can't deal anymore <laughs> with a lot of, uh, of waiting. Um, but anyways, I'll quit complaining. Things are a lot worse in the world for others and, you know, God bless you and, um, it's just my, my problems are not even problems. So I have to remind myself that to be very thankful and, um, and not worry about it. Cause you know what? It'll get taken care of. So I am thoroughly excited though. And I am very, very proud of everything that we have been able to accomplish so far in our, in our existence here. And, uh, I can't wait to show you guys and I can't wait to, uh, you know, make it happen. So anyways, thank you guys so much for stopping by. I hope I didn't bore you too much. And, um, you know, I hope you all have a wonderful week ahead and, um, be safe. Talk to you soon. Bye.